Tobias is here because he is the best boy. And he's going to help me solve all the mysteries. Aren't you, boy? Good boy. All right. Good boy. Um, so, yeah. We are going to... Tobias and I are going to find out what this deal is with Tithris is. Uh, Tithris has been missing since last night. Uh, sometimes there's some confusion where he thinks where uh, our friend uh, Kitor here thinks our, our new friend Marinth is uh, Tithris and he reprimands him but right now he seems to be kind of stuck by the bar and unable to move. But we're going to pick up what will be our final quest secret at least in the whodunit chain. Come here my boy. Come here boy. Come here boy. Come here bum. Come here bum. We're gonna go solve all the mysteries now. We're gonna solve all of them. We're gonna finally find out what's happening with Titris, Titris, what he's been up to. I still think he might be innocent, but let's find out. I, I could be wrong, and maybe I am too trusting. For a rogue, I mean, really. So here we go. I will do my duty. A treacherous race. Dodging name for a quest. Uh, Bobby and I Bobby and I finally deciphered the tablets. Finally deciphered the tablets. They tell of an artifact of immense power that was locked away in Cheerhold. Ooh. And I fear Titris is after whatever that artifact is. You may secure whatever the you must secure whatever the tablets speak of before Chitris. Bobby and I will find a guard and join you as soon as we can. Take our notes. There are many safeguards that you will need to get to, through to find the artifact's vault. Ancient Tearhold artifact notes. Fair skies and strong winds. Go to Tearhold. I mean, I kind of had a feeling uh, after spending the better part of an evening in Karazhan looking for Tears treasures and whatnot uh, that it would lead to this. So we're going to Tearhold. Right, boy? Right, Tobias? Right? Yes, let's go to Tyrell. <laughs> so much bad lag. I'm pretty sure there's a few more uh, polygons I got us to load in there. There we go. <laughs> Wait, why is Tyr moving? <laughs> Did you see that? Wait. 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 Tyr was just moving. I was I did not imagine that. And then just froze, like, oh, don't you didn't see that? Alright. Anyway. Tears playing games. I don't like it. I don't trust it. Alrighty. Let's read the note. Why am I opening up every bag I got? I didn't sell stuff from last night. Ancient Tearhold Artifact Notes. Summary. An unnamed artifact... An unnamed artifact or collection of artifacts was found by Tear. And other Titan Keepers around Azeroth long ago. Tyr focused on one cache in particular, hiding it within Tyr's hold behind a number of mechanical and magical locks. In the next few pages, we have deal t detailed the information we found about each of the locks Tyr put into place. The text do not say what was found, but the writing sounds frightened. Not a good sign coming from a Titan Keeper. We cannot let Tithra steal the artifact. Oh... I'm sure it's fine. It's fine. Next page. Lock 1, Torch of Pyrith. We believe the first lock requires a torch. We found the line below as a reference. Hopefully these keepers will be easy to discern. Eight keepers stand vigil awaiting a flame bearer. Well, my torch is always out. Eight keepers stand vigil awaiting a flame bearer. Other statues. There's another one over there. 
There was supposed to be eight, right? So... Is this one? <gasps> Wait! Oh! Something just happened! Hold on! Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! Leave me alone! Yep. Hold on. Okay. So, I have to approach each one of these, I guess. Is that it? So that's one. Okay. So, <laughs> apparently flying around not knowing what the hell you're doing is the is the solution to this puzzle. Let's say it again. Well, he's it. That's one. Um. Let's see how much we can stealth this. One. Mm -hmm. Two. I think you can tell because they're they're extra flamey. The orbs get flamey, though it's hard to see because they're so huge. So that's two. And you get a little flicker when you're close. That's three. And you can see the flame on that one. Good. It's three. Shh, motherfucker. No, no. Oh, fine. <laughs> Everything's fine. I was bound to not be able to stealth at least one time. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Making me use a healing potion and everything. Well, now I know what my survivability is around here. I've lost track of how many statues because of that schmuck. I think that was number three. So. Three. I'm trying to get as far away from these dudes as possible. Five. It's three, right? Of course, one's coming up the stairs. Why would? I'm on four, right? I'm on four. This will be five. Do those count? <gasps> yeah. Yup. Six. We're all trying to, like, not get hit by the six.
Unless we're able to both do it. Why can't I do this one? Okay, we go. Seven. Uh, yep, I see one. I see one. I see one. I see right here. There we go. Okay. It looks like I solved something. Yay. So I think what I opened, I don't know. Right. Eight keepers stand vigil awaiting a flamber. Okay, that maybe that's all I had to do for those. Um, the next is Titan Key. This one is very straightforward. Why is this thing harassing me? Um, it appears from the text only a few Titan keys were forged, including the Titan Key, which you were able to forge. Only key holders can gain approval from my golden visa visage overlooking the furnaces of the hold. Well, that's the one that's in that room. But it didn't do anything the last time I was there. Go here. You're not going to move again for me, Tyr? I saw you moving. Sneaky. Alright, let me go over here. Blessing, because this is over. This is a, see, he's standing there. He knows. Ah, look at that. You do get something. All right, I got something. I got, I got a, a I got something. Um. Tears favor sixty minutes. All right, tears favor. I'm trying to read it. So tears favor sixty minutes allows one to navigate the lower tiers of tear hold unfettered by its keepers. Oh, thank the gods. I would say thank the titans, but I still don't trust here. <laughs> but not the old gods. I'm not thinking the old gods. So now I should be able to walk amongst tears hold without being a yeah they all love me now for 60 minutes so i better be quick about this huh next thing is now that i've done that um idol of onara the third lock requires the idol scattered amidst the odd rings one must search each room to find and return all four whole to the mother oatstone charges okay so we need our burp I just had to keep an eye on how long my uh, charges stay. Uh... Oh, it's already kicked in. I already got. I already got something. All right, all I need that first step, man. It almost had me, but now I don't have to worry about being bothered by uh, keepers. So search each of the rooms. I'm thinking these are the rooms. Put my bear bone. <laughs> There's another rogue in here. No. No, it's pretty sure it's over here. <gasps> ah, right here. There we go. Titan block key fragment. Use combine two Titan block key fragments to restore the Titan block key component. <laughs> All right. So I knew these rooms were.
Titan block key from you. Buy two Titan block key from to restore the Titan block component. Alright. I've seen a lot of things all over this is expansion. This is clearly one of the objects that was shattered and is needed for the second set of artifact blocks. Now we'll work our way down. It's a little bit in a wonky order here, but... Titan Energy Core. Titan Energy Core. Um, use. Combine the Titan Energy Core and Titan Energy Cube housing to restore the Titan Energy Cube component. Okay, then. Oh, wait. Being pointed really close by. Is there another thing piece? No, now it's pointing me. Is there another one in the room? No. I thought I picked it up. I picked it up. Why is it behaving that way? Like there's another piece here. I'm not seeing another piece. Huh. Weird. Okay. Um, unless it's like a room beneath me possibly that could be if you you can't forget where i am look at the mini map and you'll see these weird overlapping rooms bird 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 ah it's over here okay what was that Does combine with something. Okay. We need four things. Oh. Oh. This is one of those rooms where there's a room above it. At least I hope it's above it. This is not below. Hallelujah. Now, does this combine with anything I have? Nope, I need to find two more. There are some stairs up. So let's go in here. Whoops. Unless those are the four pieces. This is clearly one of the objects. Wait, I should have read this sooner. This is at clearly one of the objects. This is clearly one of the objects. This is clear. Oh, God. All right. Yeah, I did. I did do all the rooms. Sorry about that. All right. Time to go to the oat stone. So, yeah. Now we have all four to... Three, four. Now, according to the instructions, I don't love Nara. There's a line that f that followed with four sets of coordinates: eight, thirteen, twenty-five, twenty-five, ten, negative two, and twenty-five. Negative 24. Kathos thinks the idol of Venera will find the scattered items amongst the circular ring tiers that lead deep into two tiers hold. We did that. That's that's these four items here in our bag. The Titan block key, Titan energy cube, Titan large Titan capacitor, and Titan focusing crystal. And two of them had to be combined. And two of them had additional pieces that had to be combined to make one. Um, so there were six pieces in all. With two of them needing common need to be combined, and that that's a total of four. Okay, seems you should be using your thinking cap near the mother oat stone at the base of the main stair. Looks important for that second part. So I don't know. Do we click on these? 
No. Um, so I guess I needed that first. But now I need to put my thinking cap on. So, 8.13. Now what I'm going to do to make my life slightly easier is take a screen cap of these coordinates. Even though it's on my screen, I just want to make sure. I don't want to keep looking for this. What is on the next page? Block 4. Okay, that's the one we have to try to bypass. So, close that. 8.13. Eight thirteen. I'm still looking for eight eight thirteen. Six ten. So this has got to be in here. All right. Eight thirteen. Ah. Well, well, well. Should be adding stream markers. Well, look, Titan Power Relay. Install the missing component. All right, now. The component is now reverting the power to the second lock. Okay, so now... I don't know what the second lock is. My guess is... Uh, the, the, the big map is almost useless for this. <laughs> I don't know why I keep referring to it. Just assumed it was going to be all the way on the other side. It was going to be this one. Okay, apparently it's something. All right. Um, Titan Power Relay. I don't know which one it is, but install the missing component. The components now rerouted power to rerouting the power to the second lock. Okay. I thought the other one was the second lock. I think I have to reset. Oh, it resets the coordinates every time you click on it. So I think I have to start from the mother stone every time is that it I know there were more of these like up there these powerhouses yeah I think there's another one over there as well is there I'm trying to do all this without doing yeah it's all these all the all the places with the big swirlies that i've been wondering what the hell those were about since i first came over to deer hole so i'm not even going to bother with coordinates at this point i know what i'm looking for install the missing component a large titan okay didn't i didn't i just do that i think this is the 25 25. So, one more piece left. The Titan Blocky, which I think was the first piece I put together. So, that would be... So, yeah, I... So, yeah, I don't know what's up with the coordinates, but... Look for the four little... housey areas with swirlies in them. <laughs> That's my clue. Times I've run in here to dodge enemies. I wonder if that key means I could always come in here and do that and be immune to uh, the nasties. Install the missing component. That sounds like something was solved. All right. So, um, the next step is.
the last part lock four Orberathmus. the last lock uses the Orberathmus, which Tithras has we hope we can bypass this lock to secure the artifact before Tithras can, can get it here is the clue return the orb of Rathmus to its console rest where Tyr can watch over it on high there's a great console at the top of Tyr hold where we both believe is the right place. Yep. I know exactly where that is. I was there earlier on here too. I was trying not to see what was going on because I didn't want anything spoiled. Ah, yeah, there's a quest on there now. An ominous artifact. An orb would fit perfectly atop a console. Secure the orb of Rathmus as well as the artifact it is hiding. I don't even know what's going on. Defeat Amaranth. Defeat Tithra! I didn't even get to see them. Are you kidding me? No, I need to know. I need to hear the dialogue. I can't conclude this quest without hearing the frickin' dialogue. That's just not right. Ugh. Alright. Tithra says, Others pull the strings. You and I are but puppets. Preservationist Catho says, Others, wait, now is not the time. We must use the orb to secure the artifact before anyone else has a chance to steal it. I'm going to stay here until I see the actual thing play out, because that's not right. You know? Other people shouldn't be able to kill, and then basically story kill. They just stole the story by killing without waiting for dialogue. That's very, very annoying. I mean, the dialogue's right here, but I want to see the actual story. And actually, I haven't secured the Orb of Rathmus. Investigate the Orb slot on the console. Optional. Secure the Orb of Rathmus. Okay, no, I haven't done that part yet. Okay, now I have. Here we go. I must thank you, adventurer. I would never have gotten this far on my own. Unfortunately, I no longer require your assistance. Time to tie up a loose end. The artifact, of course, and many more besides. It seems you have trusted that meddlesome goblin. You should have trusted that meddlesome goblin after all. Tetheris! I believed in you! I don't even know who the hell this other person is. Damn, you're strong, Tetheris. Tithras! I believed in you. Why are you making me kill you? There we go. That's the full dialogue. And now I can loot. You are ever breathless. Alright. Okay, so... What happens is... Place of Orb or of Rathmus atop the console. So, Tithra says, the artifact, of course, and many more beside. Yeah. I must thank you, Adventure. I would never have gotten this far on my own. Unfortunately, unfortunately I no longer require your assistance. Time to tie up the lo this loose end. Pre Preservationist Kepler says, Tithra, why are you doing this? Why... What do you hope to gain? Tithra says, the artifact, of course, and many more besides. It seems you should have listened to that medicine goblin after all. Tithra says, others, Tithra says, others pull the strings. You and I are but puppets. Preservation of Catholic says, others, wait, now is not the time. We must use the orb to secure the art, that artifact before anyone else tries to steal it. All right. 
This spot is clearly where the final clue suggests the orb should be placed. Place the orb of Rathus. A pulse of energy reverberates across your hold, signaling the release of a magical lock. A magical shroud lifts from an object sitting on the console. Secure the mysterious artifact. I'm trying to. Alright. Cache of Cosmic Curiosities. Cache of Cosmic Curiosities. Languages associated with order, fell, and void are engraved on the surface of the chest. It is magically sealed without a single seam or hinge. Retrieve the order of the symbols of the Orb Erasmus light up. They look the same as the symbols on the console of Retrieve the Orb Erasmus. Okay, ready for turn-in. Um, that's not it. Ominous artifact. That was a little messy because there's like 20 million people doing it tonight because it's like the first time it's available. Um, I'm not sure where I turn this in. Where do I turn this in? I guess I'm going back to Valdraken. Oh wait, no, 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 right over here. Here we go. Preservation is Cathos. How fair you! An ominous artifact, a chest locked away in Tearhold all this time. Can I examine it? Continue. Yeah, sure. Stay vigilant. The text on top of the chest is definitely Titan, but here, this is a language used by the Burning Legion. And this text is used by servants of the Old Gods. I've never seen these three languages being intermingled like this. I'm not fluent, but the Titan text speaks of a danger within the chest, an item, or perhaps just knowledge. My order will see that this chest is secured and studied. Thank you again, Olea. In my eyes, you are an honorary preservationist at this point. Good health to So I got who done it. Let me go back to we we'll take this check back chest back to Valdraken for further study. Order fell void. What could it mean? Okay, so none of them were guilty. It turned out Tithris was guilty, but something else is going on with Tithris. I don't know. I still say something was going on. His others pulled the strings. He's poor guy. I hope it I hope I mean, I don't think I was wrong that he may have... But then again, he said some words that were kind of eh. Well, let's go back to Veldrek. Hey, Chithras, where were you? You weren't working last night. Cathias, how many times do I have to say it? I am not Chithras. Will you be here tonight? Yes, Cathias, I will be here. He's always Cathy's always staying here having a drink. So, um that is the Who Done It quest line. Complete. I now have the title Honorary Preservationist. But more importantly, I'm not changing my title yet. More importantly, we have Patty. Ancient Firewine. Where did I get that from? And Patty's immediately going to like one of my favorites. Patty can't fly though, so no, he's Patty's not a pet. Patty's a mount. I think we that picture didn't show the most important part of Patty here. Patty's got a hat. 
Does he say anything new about Chetris? finest wares. Oh. Put a string marker here. You haven't heard? Seems the mad lad got caught up in some dark dealings. Had to be taken out from what I heard. The details on what happened are still sketchy. I swear that preservation I swear that preservationists and reporter were involved, but both have been pretty tight lipped since the news hit Valve Draken. You didn't hear this from me. But I heard Chithos was working with the Incarnates. Quite the scandal. The Incarnates. I guess it makes sense. My Tithers, man. Let's see if these ones have anything to say. Bobby. Hey there. Oh, okay, you can follow up. Awesome. Well, hello. You appear to have a key. Okay, we know that part. Who do you think Tithers is working with? That's going to be a tough nut to crack. I interviewed all the contacts. Fangly identified. And they knew it was that he was planning an expedition to Tearhold. Many think he was planning to leave the Dragon Isles afterwards. Should we still investigate? Well, I'm sure you're busy with other heroic deeds. The Dragon Isles has need of you yet. That I'm sure. You leave the investigating to me. I'll let you know if I pick up any leads. But you start your investigation. Well, I wasn't quite expecting this much. Well, we know Tithris wasn't working alone. We found a couple of notes on him that suggest he was contacted after the Dragon Isles reawoke. That means the group probably isn't local. And there, and if there's other caches like the one we found, that means that means that there will be others like Tetris looking for them. To what ends, I don't know. But given that they were look, working in secret, it can't be any good. I've been asking around. A few, I've been asking around a few contacts who have knowledge of Fell, Void, and Titan magic. Not that there's many of them, mind. What did your contacts have to say? Not much yet. We'll have to wait for a lead to surface. I think this nefarious group lucked out here in the Dragon Isles. But the island being so isolated for so long, that means no one had discovered the cache before we did. That may not be the case in the, in the more explored parts of Azeroth. I wonder if there's someone out there trying to keep cash like this hidden. The events here are pretty public, though. And the preservationists haven't kept the cash we found a secret. I wonder if we may soon see more of these cosmic artifacts surfacing. Ooh. Have a good one. Ooh. Interesting. I'm glad I clicked on them. I was going to sign out for the evening and not talk to any of them. Where is what's her name? Okay, here she is. I offer you my aid. What happened to the cache of cosmic curiosities we found? Wow. Okay, I've got a few things. <laughs> Bobby and I brought it straight to the Valdragon vaults. It's like nothing I've ever seen. Preservationist Ratho, Ratho is on his way to study it. He's one of our oldest members. The fell symbols, what could they mean? It's unsettling to see. After all, the Burning Legion has threatened... Azra time and time again. That said, we believe this text predates the time when Sargeras ruled over the demons of the Burning Legion. Though the exact origin has yet to be discovered. Before Sargeras. That is old. Can I ask you something about the cache? Go carefully. Well. This world is vast. Apparently wondrous. doesn't take you back. What could the old god writing signify? There has been much whisperings about the whisperings <laughs> about the old gods since Nazoth was defeated. I do remember hearing a rather odd rumor about a void creature trapped in a weapon of some sort. Oh Jesus! I shudder to think if there are such of such other artifacts. This cache, though, could it contain void energies? Such ancient chaotic forces wouldn't mix well with demonic fell or titanic order. And so the old god text troubles me the most. Further research is needed, that is certain. They're talking about Zalatath. That's referring to Zalatath. The blade. Um, that had the void beating in it. Who is rumored to be the person that supposedly you see at the end of the Dawn of the Infants dungeon that Eridicron joins in the void portal. It could be Ashara, it could be Zalatath. 
it's an elf. No one's quite sure which. Um, it could only be Ashara if Ashara reverted back to elf form and not Naga form. Otherwise, it could be Zelotath. Uh, but yeah, he, since his other defeat, I do remember hearing a rather odd rumor about a void creature trapped in a weapon of some sort. Yeah, that is in Legion. It's your your shadow priest gets as a weapon, and in BFA, it's there's a lot with the dagger, but it's a dagger that Rathian uses to cut the carapace of, of the Zoth so that you can go nuke him. <laughs> it's that they're referring to that. They're just casually dropping that into the end of this quest. Uh, so always read the quest text, is my, my suggestion. We're not even done yet. Was there any more you could discern from the Titan text? We know by its location that Tyr was entrusted with securing the cache. However, even with our knowledge of the, t of the Titan language, the text is near impossible to translate. It appears to be a cipher of some sort. I do wonder if there are other Titan vaults out there with similar artifacts. If they were hidden as well as this one, they may well, st they may well, they may, they may still be undiscovered. However, if the group behind Tethris is actively searching for them, it's the rest of its top priority to uncover and secure any other caches. When that time comes, we may just need your help. I think that's really my only other choice. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, that's, that's a lot. Uh, fell writings from before Sargeras. Um, something about the void and a casual dropping of Zalatath, basically. And Titan writings that are in a cipher. So, yeah. Interesting stuff. If needed, I will answer the call. I'm, I'm glad I decided. Let me like decide. I'm glad I decided to just click on a bunch of folks. Does he have anything? No, he just sells stuff. So that was interesting. That was interesting. Yeah, that was one hell of a night.